A deadly deputy involved shooting is under investigation in Inglewood. LA County Sheriff deputies shot and killed a man there, and a patrol car has the bullet holes to prove it. Let's CBS 2's Candace Crone is live at the scene where she spoke with his mother. Candace? DeMarco and Jass investigators have been out here for about 12 hours now. Behind me, you can see Imperial Highway here at Dottie Avenue still shut down. Now, as you mentioned, I spoke to uh, the suspect's mother. As you can imagine, she is heartbroken and confused. My baby is laying in a hospital in the morgue. Kayla Jordan rushed to the scene when she got the call that sheriff deputies had shot and killed her son, 27-year-old Edwan Stamps. It's a shot in his leg. How? Left on how? Then above his ear. It's three different. It's three different um, entry shots. She says her son is a bus driver for Foothill Transit and was picking up some food last night when shots rang out near Imperial Highway and Dotty Avenue. Investigators haven't said much about the deputy-involved shooting, but a radio call suggests the suspect was armed and inside a patrol car. You can see shattered glass from where it appears two bullet holes punctured the cruiser. Suspect is down. Suspect is inside the patrol vehicle. My mother heard the shot. She actually called us and said, um, be careful because something's going on over here. Alexis Cotton All and her family were stranded car. outside their motel right. and had to sleep in their car as deputies had the area taped off for hours. We just seen the cops just flying by and we've literally been stuck here. We had to go sleep somewhere else, which is dangerous. At this point, it's unclear how the suspect got access to the cruiser and a weapon. Now, no deputies were hurt in this shooting, but authorities say that they did recover a handgun here at the scene.